In order to stay active and positive, I believe that we need to be consciously busy, physically and mentally. Apart from our regular office work or household chores, there are a few essential things which we need to pay attention. And when we have a ready-made list of those activities and chores, we actually get around to doing them. Namaste, welcome to Home Hashtag Life and I have prepared a list of 10 things which need our immediate attention while we all are staying at home. Also, this video is in association with WOW Skin Science. So, let's get started. The way we begin our morning goes a long way in deciding how our day turns out. If we get to accomplish anything in the first few minutes of waking up, however small it is, mark my word, we feel charged and happy. When the home is given a good cleanup in the morning, it sets the tone for the rest of the day, at least for me. Studies have shown that cleaning has a positive effect on our mental well-being. Cleaning releases endorphins into our system. The happy hormones or the feel-good vibes we often experience. Let me tell you, probably that's why some of us find cleaning therapeutic. Hannah? Along with some lovely audiobook or music, it would totally sone pe sohaka. I will link some articles for you if you are interested, do check them out. Then I start my exercise or yoga. If cleaning is not your cup of tea, then find something which can make you feel good before entering the kitchen or before switching on your laptop. All we need to do is set a feel good tone every morning. Mm. This may sound repetitive, but I cannot say enough of this. This is the most important self-care which can't be missed. Exercise. Exercise to get your skin glowing, to lose the extra inches around your waist, to fit into those old jeans. Exercise to get the heart beating and the blood flowing and the toxins to leave your body. Exercise because it releases happy hormones. Whenever you get time, in the morning or in the evening, do exercise because you own it to yourself. Yoga and breathing techniques like Brahmri, chanting Om are proven to increase oxygen level in our body. So please pay attention, if not more than at least 3 days a week. Oh, and one more thing. Exercise. Our routines seem to keep changing. Sometimes not having a routine seems to be the routine. <laughs> yes, I am talking about this video. But a routine will give us some structure to our day, a method to madness, some calm to chaos. My routine checklist goes like this. Wake up, a little bit of me time, plan for the day, laundry, cook, clean, breakfast, work, lunch, Family time, snacks time, exercise, dinner time, night routines. Do put down a routine, however small it is, and pay attention to stick to it. Do you know in the flight they always say, wear your oxygen masks first and then help your loved ones. Why? Because when we take care of ourselves, we will be able to take care of others. From this example, we can relate how self-care is therefore all important. But we definitely have time crunches where we cannot indulge in elaborate time consuming processes. But a simple daily skincare tray or basket will be useful to follow a simple routine. Wash, tone, hydrate. I have been using this Wow Skin Science Upton Face Wash for more than 6 months now and lately this built-in silicone bristles are my favorite part. It aids in deep cleansing the skin and purifying the pores. 
they are not harsh and feel so soft on skin we need to use it in a circular motion on the face then wash the face and pat it dry and did you notice this don't throw the bottle we can always reuse by replenishing it a clean and clear skin always gives the best feel isn't it <laughs> after washing the face we can use this oil free upton face serum shake well take a few drops on the fingertips dab and press the serum allow some time to soak it and then moisturize as per wow skin science the percentage of natural ingredients present in the face wash is 98.30% in this serum it's again 98.30% use this qr code to check the authentication and here you go complete wupton range with this wupton face and body pack from wow skin science visit buywow.in to check more details so pay attention to your simple skin care routine as they say eyes and face are the windows of the soul let's not allow our anxiety and our worry lines to show up soon we aren't stepping out much these days and hence we may not wear too much makeup Of course looking our best inside the home really boost our self image but i'm sure the usage of most of our lipsticks or foundation or sunscreens might have sharply reduced while you are taking a short break from your work take 10 minutes out and pay attention to your makeup collection declutter and organize play some good music bring out all the makeup shift through them look for expiry dates and discard We can always stock those expired makeup items back at the right time in the makeup section less is more for me now we are left with a clean space where you can neatly arrange your kit so keep what is absolutely essential to pamper yourself at home These days medicines are the buzzword. We may have our stock of vitamins and other syrups and tablets, but sometimes we may not give them the attention they deserve. Same logic and same process. Check for the expiry dates and discard. Keep a first aid kit with the essentials. If you have elders at home, make sure that their tablets are available and stock them up. I have these baskets here. one for general medicines one for my daughter's medicines one for first aid ointments and pain relief sprays if you experience back pain often then i will suggest to keep a heat belt in your medicine cabinets you can thank me later everything at arm's reach labeled and easily accessible when needed geography in the kitchen you might be wondering what is this i know it sounds crazy right okay let me explain we have such a variety of cuisines in our country itself if we leave alone other cuisines like chinese or continental etc every now and then i like to experiment with dishes from other states every week or every day or every meal depends on our enthusiasm quotient For example this week i will be cooking a bengali dish dhokar dalna in lunch and a gujarati dish khamam dhokla in snacks a couple of days back i tried rasam and we all loved it maybe next week i am thinking that i'll be trying my hand at some kerala specialties or some recipes from northeast let's make meal time fun with an extra twist Do you like this idea of bringing our entire India in our kitchen? That is what geography in our kitchen. Do let me know in the comments do you like this idea? Pay attention what we can learn in our leisure time apart from Netflixing or binge watching. This can be a great time to learn and to teach and to learn while teaching. 
Nowadays, I am trying to learn complex camera settings for this Canon 80D which will be useful for our future content creation. Although I am not getting so much of time but still I am trying to learn interior design on Skillshare or through various YouTube channels like Home and Gardens or House and Homes etc. Learning new things like Rangoli art, mandala art or any cooking or baking skill can be a fun thing to do while we are at home. I am paying attention to teaching my daughter a few basic life skills like folding laundry, unloading the dishwasher, helping her fix a fireless breakfast, etc. There are many age-appropriate task checklists on the internet. Do give them a look and see what you can teach your little one. The sooner, the better. Wish that I could stay in this moment forever So I can hold you in my arms I will carry you on my shoulder as long as I'm able the monsters on the Who remembers playing snakes and ladders and Ludo with cousins all day during summer vacation? Who remembers Chinese checkers, scrambles and monopoly? Nowadays, we are so addicted to gadgets and the screen time, many of us have lost touch with this simple choice. How about paying attention to the old board games to play together as a family? This is our TV cabinet where we store all our board games. Needed a little cleanup and reorganizing, so here you go. The coins and pieces sorted and reunited with the respective games cards counted and neatly arranged and board games stacked away in pile. Do comment below what your favorite board games are. These days, we spend a lot of time on bed or on sofa. If living room is our movie theater, then bed is our staycation. During continuous usage, sheets trap a lot of sweat, grime, dust and dirt. So do change laundry every week and if needed, twice a week, especially during this summer and rainy seasons. While it is a good way to maintain hygiene, it is also feels really fresh and nice and energetic. Factor it in into your weekly cleaning routine. While we have given our attention to many areas of the home and to our own selves, let's turn our attention to some downtime. All work and no play make Jaya and you a dull person. We are definitely not, right? So wind down with some favorite series or movie whenever time is available. I can recommend a lovely movie, Wonder. Do watch and let me know what do you think. If you are still watching this video, then it definitely deserves a big thumbs up. Also, please share this video with your friends and family. I hope you found this activities and chores apt for today's time and they got your attention. Now, mask up, stay safe and please get vaccinated. And subscribe to home hashtag live for more such content. And you can always follow us on Instagram and Facebook for more videos, pictures and life updates. I will see you in the next one. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.